Hey everybody, welcome to Four Fun Teams! Hey! Watching E3 videos! Alright, let's play a game. Call the game as you see it. Ready? Mario Kart! Smash Caliber! So Caliber. What? So, for the record, this is not actual gameplay. How do you know? Thanks for pointing it out. I can just tell by the graphics. So, at what point is Link in this scenario, right? Like, he's fighting a 2 on 1, holding his own against two of the fastest swordsmen in the game. Link being probably arguably one of the slowest. Hey, it's another yeah. sword no, character. Sorry. Another sword. It's Trunks okay. with brown hair. The hero. That's very is specific. Smash so what I think is cool about this is they introduced another se a shield mechanic character with a completely different move list. Yeah. And considering there's only one in the game, I feel like that's great. Or am yeah. I missing something? Yeah, it's interesting to see some uh, dragon quests. Um, representation. Yeah, I mean we got plenty of Pokemon. I like some Digimon. Those are slimes, the equivalent of blue Hershey kisses. Hey, it's One Piece. A fuchsia. Ash Patchum. Ash Patchum. I Patchum. Sounds like a horrible like doctor. Me and the boys just fighting, you know, Mew, Two, and Samus. <laughs> Me and the boys attending their own funeral. Yeah. Funeral. <laughs> Snooze. Well, that's interesting. Yeah, they have mechanics. That's actually really cool. It's it's kind of like how they how they worked with the Joker's. Right. I did not. Let me ask you a question. Like, they're quite a lot Do these mechanics make these characters OP? Because nobody else has stuff like that. Now look at Captain Falcon. He has nothing like that. Like your older characters don't get this treatment, and they all have their own unique games. So do you think do you think these new characters now are a little OP because of that, or just more detailed? Probably just more detail. The fruit is super fresh. How do they balance them? Yeah. How do they balance that? How do you think they balance that? Matches. So they make old characters stronger? Yeah. Very much. Oh, okay. Common consensus. New game! This is your first uh, direct? Mm -hmm. Awesome. So all your questions will be answered. Right, when they were recording it. So you probably missed the uh, yes. whole production. So, and thank you for your for your sacrifice being there. I heard E3 this year wasn't that great. I you know, moved up my flight and came home last night. Got you. Yeah. Oh. Jackie Chan? In this, that's racist. <laughs> that's clearly Jet Li. Whole different country. Oh yeah, that's right. He's the vice president now. Yeah, he is. Hi everyone. I'm American. Is his name really Doug Bowser? His name is Doug Bowser. That was the whole point of that intro. They better have a racing game. Not because I want one. But because... No, I don't. I hate racing games. But they said it's something for everybody. I know somebody out there wants a racing game for Switch. So this, is, like this one right here is made for little kids, right? Things take a dark turn. Listen, we begin yeah. our tour yeah. by taking in some sights and sounds. You may never it's a disturbing leave. horror story. This one is? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, it still seems suited for young, young kids. Yeah, young kids. Yeah, but ghosts, ghosts, are, ghosts, are, but ghosts are a known thing for young kids now. Yeah, but do you know the story behind it? Yeah. yeah. Those ghosts murdered his parents. Mm -hmm. Now he's got secret revenge on them. Well, he murdered Mario and Princess so. and the Toads. as well. It's a Luigi version First of Ghostbusters. It's like a Luigi's version of Schindler's List. Schindler's. Huh? Schindler. Costco's. This is definitely geared towards general audiences. I would buy it. Really? Why? 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 And a bit too much like Ghostbusters, like they ripped it off. Hey! When you need a frame, but you just can't make a new one? Well, that's actually kind of cool. Like, uh, do a, uh, local expansion Yeah? I'd be about that life. Like, once or twice. It's kind of like, uh, Sanford. Yep. And face any challenges the tower throws at you. What a place to wake up in. A haunted hotel with floor after floor of oddities. Many traps and mysteries <laughs> ghosts lurk within. I like will be I like how missing Mario extra. and friends. And his team like, run the like Luigi. They have faith rests David, in your you're hands. staring him down the second he picked up the plate. Oh, it's okay, it's not like it's on camera. <laughs> Took one bite of that wing, DJ. I'm the only one, dude. Mm -hmm. 
So scale of one through ten, what do we think about Luigi's house party? Uh, zero? And we can afford to see our mansion. Zero. It's, it's got a strange hole of a I feel like it's one of those places that the guy from Sign Night Live will send you when he talks about the clubs in New York. Oh, yeah, Stefan. Yeah, Stefan. Are you outside of spot? Luigi's mansion. Luigi's mansion. Anyway, so as far as Luigi's mansion, I never played the first two. Looks fun. Are new okay. It is. I, I've, I've, uh, I can well, I've played the, the, the older version. It's a lot of fun. To learn what other I find it to rip off the Ghostbusters. Lean forward. For immature no, audiences. What is this a Crypt Keeper or a... Oh my god, a strategy game. What? Oh my god. Is this a game? This is a game. Imagine chess, but way more complicated. Oh. Yeah, chess if you can move all your pieces at the same time. I've never played that. Yeah. Imagine Traffic in 95, but way more complicated. Jim Hansen's. Oh, great. So they're in the same universe as Sesame Street. Uh, that's, that's pretty cool. It's canon. It's it, canon. It's canon. The Muppets canon. That explains Just when I think they, they the can't Muppet. make Link cuter, they do. Like, now he doesn't even have any eyebrows. You're gonna enjoy part three of JoJo's. Mm. <laughs> if you like that. Okay. Oh, if you're into baby fighting babies with fetuses. Show <laughs> your babies into fetuses. Tune into uh, season three. Watch this once you get to that point. I'm gonna like show you this video at this point of the video again. Did this man just eat an apple? Yeah, yes. I saw that. Very so, this is another too. like five year old game. You came with five year old fights? No. It's a remake of a classic game. They couldn't handle this. This game was super complicated for five year olds. Really? Yep, I played it when I was five. Zelda was one of the most complicated games on Nintendo yeah, when I was a child. Yeah, it changed. I don't yeah, know what it, time, is, it was but... very. There was a lot of stuff. Like it was very it does, detail oriented. It doesn't look horribly violent. Therefore, it's for kids. No, it has nothing to do with the violence aspect. It just. I don't know what it is, but it just seems again very for younger audiences. Why? Because of the graphics and it's small. You think... The graphics, the music. It sounds very Disney-ish. So you're judging a book Wait, by is this like cover. a dungeon builder? It looks like that. That's actually really dope. For a Zelda game? It's like those custom, like, quests wow. that people make. Yeah, it reminds me of, um, Isaac. <laughs> Why do you like it? Well, it's kind of like, you know how there's, uh, the Super Mario Maker? Mm-hmm. How about, they should make a Zelda Dungeon Maker. I think you just saw it. So I'm a huge fan of Square Enix. I have no idea what this is. Same. You're a huge fan of it, but you don't know what it is? And this is a new IP. Oh, okay, cool. What does that mean? Trials of Mana. So it's a remake of um, one of the secrets of, Secret of Mana games. Ooh. So I have a thought. You know how they're remaking a lot of Disney movies into live action and using real people? Yeah. It would be neat to see Zelda as a live action video game with a piece of a real person pre controlling a real what? It's interesting, but also sounds The whole really collection cool. of mana is available right now on the eShop. Hello, I just said something. Yeah. I noticed you said something. Is this the Witcher? There's the Witcher. It's the Witcher. I didn't see a lot of I didn't expect the Witcher. Oh, yeah, that was great. Switch, that's new. Yeah. I don't know what we're doing about that. That's a great title. I never played it, have you? Yeah, no, I haven't either. Well, in the comments, let us know if you want to see The Witcher be well, played on our channel. We meet back at the monastery exactly five yeah. years from today. I still want to Japan see. loves their Japanese uh, anime. Don't is say. Is this? Kingdom Hearts is a great game. Look, Fire Emblem. Hey! This, I was iffy on this for a while. I think I'm going to get this. Oh, they, they missed a golden opportunity. That could have so, been Fire Emblem anyway, Treehouse. between the two of you, that's oh, like Kingdom Hearts. So you're not gonna ask me if I was PlayStation. No. Anyway, so which house you gotta go with? Number four. Our house. Ding, ding. In, in the, the middle, middle of the street. street. That's not all what he's saying. He just said I'd like to be at 7-Eleven right now. Might be fun to play. Where I can get a fresh ramen at a location. Not what you like said. This. All right. I give a hundred dollars to either Fresh or Jen if they Resident can name Evil. if they can name all the games that have been announced up to this point. Go. Link. Zelda. <laughs> Mario Kart. Yeah. Luigi's Amen. Mansion. Amen. Luigi's Mansion. And one more. If you if you if you even get if you even get the one right. It's Luigi's Mansion. Got it. Cool. 
All right, Fresh, give your best shot. From front to oh, end. Dude, I don't know. They all look the same to me. <laughs> wow. Yeah, they did. After Luigi's Mansion. Especially the Zelda ones. Got it. Oh, I thought this was a good one. I, like I, too, like to play my Switch in a haunted hotel. I mean, yeah. what other way to feel like you're at home, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of like when I'm at work and I, I see all the... Ooh, oh, I called it. Did 4 already come to the Switch? I... I'm not sure. Playing a Resident Evil game in a place like that might not be my way to play, but I bet you could like find your way to play, don't you think? For now, Who wrote his lines? Take a look. There's no more heroes? I guess it is. I thought they already made the sequel. No more Heroes 3. From the making of Guitar Hero. Welcome to the And then, girl. and then Kakuin's gonna be like, oh, wow, 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 wow. Yeah. <laughs> but you really just do that? That was cool. Contra! Contra! What? Okay. Oh, snap. I, I didn't expect that. That was my jam. Wow, that's pretty deep. I was not expecting. Yeah, that's yeah. super deep. Okay, this game, I was looking forward to, then I tried the demo, and it was very simple. This looks like the spiritual successor to Zone of Enders to me. Like it feels very Zoe inspired. Inspired. Yeah. Like Zone of Enders needs a Gundam. See, like the, the problems having. It's like you get that how choppy it was when all that stuff is going on. Uh, see, like the frame rate reduction when they get popping. I hope so. Maybe they fixed that in the full version. Demon X Machina. Steam. Damon X. It's Demon. It's pronounced Demon X. Demon X. Machina. It's Demon X. Machina. Look, the graphical upgrade is tremendous on this new Monster Hunter. No, I'm kidding. I have no idea what this is. What's the guess first? Jen? Jurassic Park 5. Looks like it's Andrew Dragon. Dragon 2. I'm gonna go with Sonic 7. Avatar. <laughs> Sonic 7. Yeah. They haven't made a 5 yet. <laughs> it's Yu Gi Oh! <laughs> That's <laughs> clearly, clearly, clearly blue eyes by Charlie. Yeah, go with Pokemon at this point. Watch well, this sack. It's really not Pokemon. Panzer Dragon called it. What? Yep, said he it did. yesterday. He did say it. He told, he told Mech yesterday, who Mech announced this yeah. tonight. Yep, yep he said yeah. it yesterday. Yep. It's on the phone record. Alright, so he's gonna come out this winter. Hey, put glass! <laughs> Same guy or no? Oh. <laughs> 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 Alright, <laughs> cool. <laughs> He's Jackie Chan. Keep it moving. Subscribe to that one. He put the same guy. He just put glasses on. Oh, Riot You. I called it that. I haven't seen Riot You in so long. Okay, oh. guys, on the 15th, it's going to down. be on 10 times before this, this ad starts. Sword or yeah, shield, man? Right What's there. it going to be? Aqua shield. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> in the Nintendo I'll go with sword. Oh, cool. cool. yeah. I'm an agent of shield, man. So I'm pretty sure. Pokemon Sword. Oh man, I might get a switch just for this. Yeah, it's supposed to be the truth. You know what? Can is we, this can we is this back a little bit? I kind of want to hear what he's telling me about this game. No. Okay. Is this more <laughs> going back to like the classic red and blue? No. no, no. That's one of the. It couldn't be farther from red and blue. But I mean, as far as like the sword and shield. Why is there a black or Nestle? Is that Japan? It's a knockoff of Japan. Like Japan, America. Okay, this is probably. Oh, I like these graphics. Seems like cell shading is. Coming really common lately. Did you notice that? Uh, at least with Nintendo. Yeah. I think because Nintendo's always trying to separate it's themselves. Kind of, yeah. Well, it's kind of got like this Borderlands esque kind of thing. I like it though because sometimes when you try and do your graphics too lifelike, like you, you're just sitting there and you're trying to separate like yeah. how real it is. Like if you think you compare like uh, Zelda Wind Waker to uh, like Twilight Princess. Twilight Princess? Yeah. It's like, Twilight Princess just looks too edgy compared to Wind Waker. Yeah, what was that chick from, um, sorry, that woman, I can't say that, 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 uh, that, that woman on uh, Soul Calibur, who had that sword. Ivy? Yeah. Yeah. She had the same weapon and the same shorts. Mm -hmm. So this, this is the one we were talking about earlier. Really, right? uh, so I mean, like, Bayonetta, but with robots. I hope it's like, because they sh they start off showing two characters. I hope it's like two player, like co-op Bayonetta. 
August 30th. Wow, that's pretty soon, actually. Pretty, you think it's pretty soon? Probably a little ways off. I mean, it's before the end of the year. Your name! Uh, apparently, in Mafia, you, know, you can go backwards in time. You, you can wear socks and no pants. Empire of Sin. Ah, I like it. Sounds cool. So, Conquest Nintendo Champions five, eight. owns Marvel? Not owns, but they can... Hey, you you I know, that's why I'm propping up on my shoulders. <laughs> so I can talk directly in the mic. <laughs> Yo, you know what I heard? Is uh, Universal Studios bought the right to Nintendo? Like Mario and Sonic? And oh, they paid for that? Yeah, they're gonna build like a Nintendo themed section of the park now. Oh, neat. To compete with Disney and Marvel and Star Wars. Have you ever noticed that? Like, traditionally, Thor has never had a beard. I mean, right. in Marvel. Thor has never had a beard, right? Ever since the movies, they keep giving him a beard. I think because, uh, the same thing with Captain America, it gives him, like, that darker, eggier look. There we go! Oh, yes, baby. Yeah! Yeah! Show me them Olympics! <laughs> Rock climbing! And it's fitting because the Olympics are in Japan. Oh, well, that's true. Yeah. Oh, so they're gonna add surfing and rock climbing to the Olympics? Well, apparently they have uh, secrets we didn't know about. Yeah. What'd you say, Jen? It's in Tokyo. Oh, which is where? In oh, Chernobyl? So is that the same guy? <laughs> he said he didn't know. Oh, we got a new guy. Uh, just took his glasses off. Back to Jackie Chan 1. <laughs> the old guy took his glasses off. He's falling asleep. Just Animal Crossing. <laughs> you can be a girl. <laughs> is that your thing? Like bangs and ponytails? That's my thing. Women stranded. <laughs> I like that. I can hear what you're saying. You know, I like this game. I'm not even gonna <laughs> lie. I like the strategy and like just having to build from nothing. Yeah, you do. Um, you know, like New Horizons. Hey, there's black people now. Yeah, with Token? red hair. Before you can only be before you can only and be raccoon <laughs> people. You can be white or an animal. I actually saw that on uh, I saw that on Reddit. I, 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 I like it. I like it. You guys would go and release. purchase this game. Yeah, yeah. Some I would honestly. Spiral. Is this the old one? Oh, oh it's a trilogy. Yeah. Still the song. Why is that name familiar? Minecraft Dungeons. It's not real Minecraft, it doesn't count. Unless it's a crossover with Mystery Dungeon. Hmm. Does that look like Discount Skyrim to you? That didn't look awesome. Skymere? Doom? Doom, baby. Doom, that's a good card. I have one of my favorites. Does your team already have a keeper of the quilt? What? Does your team already have a keeper of the quilt? I don't believe so. Okay. Let's all talk about Jen because her eyes are closed. Jen! Yes? What do you think? I think it's amazing. No. That's the other one. Um. It's a five year old. Just dance. What do you think? Just dance. I love dance. Yeah, but Just Dance. Just Dance is great. What do you think about this year? It's the All Racist Edition. <laughs> you said it's not going to please Katana? It's the All Racist Edition. Wait. What do you think about this? Is that Tails? Mm -hmm. Thanks. Whoa, Super Mario, Mario Maker. Oh, it's, it's coming out this month. I didn't, even know, I didn't know that. Okay, K Rule is way smaller than he normally is. Because that is totally not who you think it is. That was a nice troll. 
Characters that no one thought would come to Smash, even though everyone asked for them. This is probably a holdout from the last game, to be honest. I'm sure there is. I don't know if it's client facing, though. Caesar! Alright. Smash and Banjo Kazooie. Cool, does that mean we're gonna get a remake of Banjo Kazooie 2? We have more games in development beyond what we've shown you today. Yeah. I'm looking forward this, to the game we can Metro introduce them to. I'm hoping that's just a redead. Stay in that frame for a really long time. Guy, so you slow down in the current rooms? Or play them all at the same speed? Yeah. Sequel to Breath of the Wild is in development. Oh, thank you for the update. <laughs> guys. Okay. What do you guys think? What were you looking forward to? Um, oh, you can go what we first. Just saw? Yeah. None of them. Nothing was appealing to me. Okay, people who actually matter. What was, what's your guys' opinion? Bruh, let me tell you something. I'm here. I matter. Try me again. Oh, and I'll no. spit into that microphone. Um, Spitfire. Um, I I enjoyed it. I'm not a huge Nintendo fan, but they had a couple of cool <laughs> games coming out. I like uh, a couple of things they were doing with a lot of the retro <laughs> games, how they were um, including all of the old vintage versions of games, like with uh, Contra and um, Contra, Resident Evil, and a few of the other games. Like I thought that was neat. Bring back the old <laughs> nostalgia. Yep. Uh, other than that, I mean, a lot of a lot of those games just look the same to me. I'm not gonna lie, because I'm not a huge like. I, I think a lot of, like, the anime-esque games blended in right. a little bit. And like I said, I'm not that big of a Nintendo fan to really separate myself in those strategy games and stuff. Um, but, I mean, overall, <laughs> I thought it was cool. What? Can I go? Yeah. Go ahead. All right. I hope you heard Derek. Yeah. Uh, all right. Way back Keep there. Oh, that's right. But that gets edited out. All right, so definitely looking forward to watching more Shielded Swordsman and Smash Brothers. I think it's going to be dope. Um, Shield and Swords and Smash Shielded Brothers. Swordsman. Oh, you all know Swordsman. how I feel about Smash Brothers. Though. combining Pokemon with... Uh... No, I'll get there. <laughs> um, oh, Pokemon. Yeah, excited about that. A lot, of, a lot of new-ish IPs coming. Yeah. More like, I think they're just filling genres at this point, and I'm actually okay with that. Considering the Switch sales have been declining, I think it'd be awesome to, like, actually see some new life get breathed into the console mm -hmm. by having so many different options for people to play. Yeah. JRPG, arcade, you know, all the other stuff that people may or may not want, it's available. So that's pretty neat. Hey, but no racing games. You called it. You did. Um, At least on Nintendo side. That was a Nintendo specific. So I wanted to really... I um, know, I said at really... least on Nintendo side. I think what I'm looking forward to most is probably either going to be one of those JRPGs, Smash. I'm not a Resident Evil person. What's up with Smash? We've it's already never, never discussed why Smash sucks. We discussed why Smash is amazing and you're wrong. No. We discussed yeah, we did. We had the pros no and the cons. Either. Call us having an entire like, so three yeah, minute no discussion. Time, right. <laughs> and a couple and we of y'all agreed with me as to but... what were the issues were in Smash Brothers. Really? So she doesn't take off days in the middle of the week? What? Yeah. Who? Huh? Who doesn't take off days in A sports commentator. <laughs> <laughs> okay. When y'all so, think this is gonna get smashed. Anyway, back to what we were talking about. Um, I think Astral Chains looks pretty cool. Um. Yeah. Um, I'm not. I haven't played any of the other Animal Crossings. It looks pleasant. That's really all I have to say. I mean, they stick, I feel yeah. like I don't play them, but I feel like I don't they play stick, them, but they look good. If they stick to the formula, you can't go wrong. It's kind of like a Pokemon. 
Yeah. Like, yeah. So reskin the formula, add a couple features, people are going to buy that game. Yeah. Yeah, five year olds. So. Five year olds? Yeah, buy games. Animal Crossing. Yeah. Seriously? Okay, Jen, what what game would you oh, boy. None of the ones that were featured on here. You didn't okay, answer the well, question, though. They don't there know what you want, so that tell them what you want. Here. What kind of game would you play? What game would you I play? I know, I think it's still very old school. school. Like, you like the old games where, like, they just let women play around in the sink with dishes? Yes. I like that game. My fault, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you said uh-huh. it by default. Mm-hmm. Unfortunate we're recording. If you laugh at it, you said it. Right. He not only <laughs> laughed at it, he contributed. But seriously, what kind, what kind of game would interest you then? Nintendo is listening to this, so they want to hear your opinion as a female. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What does it have to do with being a female? A lot. It's called deflection. Girls have different viewpoints on games than guys. It's called do. you not trying to answer the question directly that you were asked. It's called diversity. And you're just feeding it. Great. Now we're talking about diversity in gaming. <laughs> when all we want to know is how many games she did not remember from the anime direct we just watched. All right. I remember. That's them right. All. I called it I anime direct. Them all. I saw them all. And Name the one game. Luigi's Mansion, Animal Crossing. That wasn't mentioned. Zelda. Oh, it's just now. That wasn't. Nope. Zelda there wasn't was a game. There was a Zelda or a Link or something. Whatever. Oh, Pokemon one coming out. Okay. Where are the subtitles? In Japanese. <laughs> but what kind of game would interest you? Like in all seriousness. A game with one button or less? No. It's like a movie? Because you said classic games. So you mean like Galaga where you literally only have two I buttons mean, to I play with? I mean, I did like the Super Mario games. I do like Mario Kart. I do like all of those. Um... Just the ones that were showcased here, none of them appealed to me. A lot work. of them also seemed to me that they were for more, they, they were for younger audiences. They were childlike. What do, you, what do you think Super Mario Kart is designed to appeal to? All audiences. So no, what's, no. what's an adult-oriented game in your definition? Hold on, hold on. We just watched a Nintendo Direct, right? What in the Nintendo Direct appealed to you? She just Which said game? nothing. No, no, to. something did. So out of all the ones that didn't appeal Jackie to you, Jackie Chan. Okay, see, so you're all about those announcer guys. No, I'm into the games. I'd like to see a game that would appeal to me, and none of the ones that were featured appealed to me. Right, and so the skill that of didn't appeal to me and absolutely didn't appeal to me. Which one appealed to you the most? None of them. I get that. And in the order, what is the order? Was Which one was like an absolute no? Which one was just like no? All of them were absolutely no's. Right. And so in the realm of absolutely and no. One of them was must have been potentially mm-hmm. slightly more. It's than literally most attractive, no. least attractive. Come on, you know how to play this game. So which one is it? What could you say something positive about? What can you say about any of the games that were displayed? Besides that you didn't like them. And besides that Derek already said Zelda. I think that some of the graphics were pretty, pretty cool. What? Go on. That's one sentence. Women fought so hard for the right to speak. Say something. Something. There we go, kids. Wrap it up. We're going home. Roll the credits. Wow. You got the floor. You got the floor. Talk. I hate when you put me on the spot. The you tendo, jumped into a four-man talk to panel. Hear this stuff, You're so going to have the spot. Four-man. What are you? Three, a woman. So speak. Three man, one woman panel. So speak then. I told you. I just spoke, but apparently that's not good enough for you guys. I okay. told you none of them appealed to me. I told you a lot of them were, to me, intended for younger audiences, for children. None of them spoke to me. So my question goes back to, in your definition, like what kind of games appeal to an older crowd? It's one of those things that... I'm not saying all of them were for younger crowds. There were some that appealed to older crowds, but just for me, no. I'm not saying all of them were for younger crowds. Okay. But so the video did its job then. At the vi- at the beginning of the it video, did they, they clearly stated it that they were... It did its job. Right. And no, it, it, I don't believe that they provided enough games that would... Appeal to all audiences, no. I feel like you're you're focusing too much on the games you didn't like, and you're trying to make that the summary of the video. 
Because I'm none of the games. I don't care what who you're with, quite frankly. Um, because I feel like you're backtracking on everything that you're saying. You're you're saying in one instance, I hated everything. Nothing was for adults, and then you're saying, well, some of it was for no, adults and some of it. Some was of for it children. was for adults. I'm telling you, there were a lot of it that was geared towards younger, in my opinion, younger audiences. There were some that were geared towards adults, and none of them appealed to me. All right. Okay, Johnny. but that that's a matter of personal opinion, which is fine. Right. Um, but that that's that's not to say they they Johnny, did a great job. Persona, what is Persona Five designed to appeal to? What age group? The horny age group. Mm-hmm. Exactly. People walk around with cocks and what in does their it hands. look like? Huh? And what does the game look? Oh, like? sorry, it looks like uh, <laughs> like a cartoon. That's see. So my point is, cartoon does not mean for kids. No, I didn't say cartoon. I mean, no. Listen, games, don't fall into this trap. There's no trap. Yeah, it is. You didn't say cartoons, right? No. You didn't say anything. I did say something. You said the graphics. I said the graphics were pretty cool in some of them. You said the graphics looked like they were designed for younger people. It's all being recorded. We don't believe you. Let's play okay. it back. I said no. I did say the graphics were pretty cool. Didn't I? Yes, you did. Thank you said you. the graphics like they're designed for younger children. Because no, none games. of those mechanics, none games. of those mechanics are designed for younger children. I said kids. some of the games, but I said the graphics were pretty cool. He heard so, me. So, so what? What, in your opinion, makes the games feel like they're made for children? Then, uh, just the mechanics of them, the doingness of the games. You know what they're doing what mechanic, in the game. What are the mechanics that are designed for kids? That parrot's going crazy right it now. It seemed pretty small. Like, pretty easy. Too easy. Some of them seem very easy, very childlike. That's all I'm saying. What makes the game bad? You know, it's bad. It's just... <laughs> okay, thanks, Jen. How do you know that, Jen? Because of the way it is. <laughs> like the guy said, you know, it's for Someone's children. Someone's aching for a hurt, and that's all I'm saying. Yeah, so for those of you who don't know, Jen is our equivalent of Aaron Hansen, of Ego Raptor, who basically... Knows what she hates, but doesn't know what she likes. Wow, that was deep. I know what I like. That was deep. Describe it. Tall, dark, and handsome. What is that? I'm too short. It's not being specific. <laughs> what game? What sequel to what game is that? Yeah. You should just say you're too short. Yeah. That's a good idea. Uh, you see the, like, those beams of like. I like that because you didn't cross out like, anything else. Nope. Like, uh... <laughs> I am short, dark, and handsome. <laughs> Guess I failed your test. <laughs> yeah. You, get, you see, like, those beams that are, like, screenshots of Tinder, and someone's like, like, how tall are you? And it's like, I'm short. And like, ew, you're disgusting. I'm like, well, how big are you? How dare you say that? You're sexist. <laughs> right. How fat are you? No, oh, well, you know, you can't ask me that. Yeah. I think Coax into his staff, who got to the point where it's just, like, it's a horizontal line, <laughs> or it's a <laughs> vertical line, <laughs> horizontal line. <laughs> That's just it. It's like wow. simplify. That's great. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. At, they did that with uh, the me and the boys too, where it's like it's just four different colored points. Yeah. They had one with uh, was it Sully or whatever his name is from Monsters Inc. Yeah. He was talking to the other guy, or who's the guy with the one eye? If I get this right. Uh, Mike. Mike and the bigger guy was Sully. Yeah. So Mike is is like girls that are five ten or five feet talking about you're too uh you're too short for me and the guy's like five eight. It's like no nah, you're too short for me, man. I need six feet or taller. It's like you're five yeah. feet tall. So anyway, I think we're done here. Alright. This is this is how we know when we're done is when we start devolving into uh things that have yeah, actually matter and sense. What? Nothing. All right, well shout out to our sponsors, Old Spice, Deodorant. Thank you, Old Spice. Deodorant made for children. Mm-hmm. I've known a lot of no, people. I know? I know a lot of people red. who have actually broken out using Old Spice. Huh? I don't think it's a great brand. What'd you say? I know a lot of people who have actually broken out in hives using Old Spice. Well, that's why Old Spice isn't paying you. Mm-hmm. In hives? No, not hives. He's pay- they're paying like us. Like or something? Yeah. What? Yeah. See, all of this. <laughs> this is the real reason for the pay gap. Hmm? This is the real reason for the wage gap. Yeah. We have to we have to shout out our sponsors. Yeah, old shout spice. out to Old Spice for Old Spice and, and also Trojan. Old Bay seasoning. Don't forget Trojan. Trojan. Well, I have to make brand. everything dirty, Jen. Not. Purple brim. Oh, that's right. If We're, Trojan like, did his job, like none of us would be here the whole time. And I realized, oh yeah, the camera's still there. I know. Well, Facts. Trojan wasn't being used. And they support terrorists. Obviously. Mm-hmm. I think we're done. <laughs> Obviously, I wasn't there. I was there, but I wasn't there until later. Facts.
Okay. The biggest swim in the Were you balls. told? I topped on the train. Moved into a new place. <laughs> yep. I used to have a ton of brothers and sisters, Dan. I used to be white. Thank you.